Hold it right there. Okay. Okay, so you got it on your eye? Yeah. All right, we're about to insert the Procara, which is a cryogenically preserved amniotic membrane for the sole purpose of healing recurrent corneal erosion. Look down. Good. Keep looking down to your floor. Now look up. Good job. Look straight ahead. This will be centered here. Now the membrane is centered over the eye, at which point you could open your eye now. The membrane is on. You're able to see there's a ring. And as the cryogenically preserved amniotic membrane infuses your cornea with healing properties, this recurrent corneal erosion will hunker down and hopefully not reoccur. With a little luck, not reoccur ever. I'm going to give you a little partial torsorophy. I'll show you how to do that. But we want to make sure that this ring, which when you look at it, can move around. And look down for a second. As you look down, you can actually massage the top to keep it centered. Look straight. Look straight towards it. Right here. Good. So right now, the membrane is perfectly in position. Some people use a little partial tarsorophy, where we look to take from the corner of the eye a little bit of uh, this, what we call tegraderm. And Tegraderm is then used to give a partial closure of the eye. Some of these come in different sizes and can be cut. Other people say, close your eye. A partial closure allows for the membrane to not come out. Now you can open your eye and you'll see it'll be hard to open. There'll be a little crack there. You can see a little light in there. This would be a, a partial eye closure partial tarsorophy and with the use of this tegraderm but if you notice it still leaves an opportunity for you to put an ophthalmic drop in I'm going to be giving you drops one drop in the right eye four times a day till I see you again and the healing properties of this Procara will allow the recurring corneal erosion to go away the cornea to thicken and remodel smoothly and because it's in the center we're afraid of this problem disrupting your central acuity as you get older. So that's what we're going to do. All right.